One school district in the metro is looking ahead to next year and focusing on flexibility for its students and their families. And part of that goal in Clayton County is offering up a virtual learning program. Liza Lucas, registration is open now, right? So what do parents need to know here? Yeah, those applications open now. They're going to continue through the end of, for, over the course of the next month. And really, this is for grades 3 through 12. So if you like that at-home virtual learning option, well, district wants to give you a choice in that going forward into the fall. Now they do make clear that students would stay enrolled in their currently zoned school, but all the instruction would be online. Again, grades 3 through 12. This will be a free option according to the district, and it's going to be a mix of virtual live and independent learning as all this is done for the learning program again in Clayton County. And the district really made the point that they're doing this because the landscape of education has really changed over the course of the past year, and they wanted parents to have the option to figure out what works best for them. Once the landscape changed, we have to make some adaptations to be able to meet the needs of, of all students. And some students have been very successful in this virtual learning environment. Now, one thing the district does ask is when you apply that students commit to at least one semester of this virtual option. Just something to note, Sheba, as you head over to that application process. Yeah, certainly uh, a lot of questions to be asked by parents through this process, too, because a number of school districts are doing exactly what Clayton County is doing. But, uh, you know, just make sure that they're still part of that school community. It's one of the questions you have to ask. One thing I found out, Chesley McNeil, let's turn it over to you. Liza, thank you.